this windscreen is so dirty. It is 5.51 a.m. Ciao amici. Hey guys, we're an Aussie Italian family of six traveling around Italia. Join us. Fab. Tiff. Bella. Luca. Sophia and Elisa. Hey, buongiorno. It's 5.51 a.m. and we are on our way to Rome. Yay. We thought we'd try and beat the crowd, so we're going a bit early. And hopefully there won't be too many people, but we'll be there. We'll be there about six, just after six. And so hopefully, hopefully we'll find a car park as well. I'm not sure where we're going to park. And it's a minimum of five euros an hour. So we're going to try and find a park and take you to the Cherry Fountain. Hopefully before the crowds. But you never know in Rome. You never know what's going to happen. We parked in Trastevere, one of the most charming neighbourhoods in Rome. So sweet. First things first, cappuccino. We found a little bar. Ooh, so excited guys. We're going to go see La Fontana di Trevi, the Colosseum, right past Piazza Navona. We're going through these little secret roads. Watch this. Piazza Navona without all the people. No, guys, look at this. Oh, look, somebody's getting married. That is early. They're at no, this is the Pantheon, guys. We are. Well, that's usually. Uh, <laughs> we're very early. Wow. On our way to La Fontana di Trevi. <laughs> that's the Trevi Fountain. We made it. Look, 7:30 a.m. Like everybody else. This is um, this is a small amount of people. <laughs> We're meant to be here at six. It's going to get crazy soon, so this isn't even that many people. But we might make it down. Didi! Wow! Are you in the Trevi Fountain, guys? Wow! Beautiful. There you go, everyone is going down to the Trevi Fountain. Oh, that's so cool. 
legend has it, if you draw a coin in, you'll come back to Rome. Getting told off by the police. <laughs> yep, apparently our little boy was trying to steal money from the fountain. Bella, where are you? Um, at the Chevy Fountain. Is it beautiful? Have you got anything to say to Nina? This is Nina's favourite spot. It's a nice <laughs> the Trevi Fountain was built in the 18th century. It's 26 metres high and 49 metres wide. An estimated 3,000 euros is thrown in the fountain every single day. Okay, fresh water, yay. Now you're getting all wet. Let's go, guys. Luca, did you get wet? Did you get wet, Luca? Yeah, me too. I bet I, I was putting at least a, at least a This is 40 minutes before this the Pantheon opens. Wait, are we going to here and Look at the line are already. We going, so <laughs> we went to the now are we going in here and then... We are at the Pantheon now. Look at this. Barb's waiting in the line. And I'm supposed to be watching Elisa. He's got free range. <laughs> La Fontana. Interesting. Lisa. The Pantheon Dome is still the world's largest unreinforced concrete dome. Look at this. Look, Look at this. What? It's worth 40 minutes. Well, it's pretty beautiful. <laughs> no, don't squeal at least. Look, there's Jesus. They're touching his scar, look.
sing a song. Sing a song. Sing a song. Beautiful. It's for a two or more. Hey guys, you don't even have to do that anymore. We did it for you. It was beautiful. This is the outside of the Pantheon. Are you ready? Ready, Luca? Yeah. Straight ahead. Can you see it? You mean that? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> that doesn't look like the oh, we're, Well, we're going to get closer. There we go. We've got the Roman Forum over here. Luca, what did you find? I found the gold. <laughs> that? That is a that is a rectangle. That's right, that's going round. That is way bigger than that and that is way bigger than that. Luca just found Caesar. Right there. We are on our way to the Colosseum. Look at this, we made it. The Colosseum is the largest ancient amphitheatre ever built. The gladiators will fight and the Christians will get killed here because they lifted up the name of Jesus everywhere they went. Okay, so we're probably not the smartest travellers. We didn't pre-book tickets because the last time there was just a line and you booked it, but now it's all online. Obviously, why didn't we think of that? But anyway, so we've met a guy who's trying to get us a ticket and we'll see if we can get in. <laughs> I thought it would be fun to walk this with the pram. <laughs> it's very uneven. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> well, we're not going to be able to get into the Colosseum today because we didn't buy tickets online earlier and our car um, our car ticket expired in an hour so we're going to get a gelato well it's a good thing we threw a coin into the Trevi fountain we'll be back Bella, don't worry we'll be back can you do it Bella? Apparently I make them walk. Piazza di Spagna. And look, they even have a Spanish flag. Oh, there's no flowers. Just so there's only fiori là. <laughs> this is from a 5 a.m. time. <laughs> Hello. Ciao, belli. <laughs> we have made it to the Spanish steps. The but girls, on the two Still kids hot. are asleep. There's usually flowers all up here, but there are none. I can't remember the flowers, but... I remember the flowers. I remember, remember important flowers, things. Piazza di Spagna. Cute. 
Where are we, babe? This is where my hubby or my engagement ring. There you go. Not bad, not bad, hubby, eh? We thought it would be nice to go for a little walk down to Villa Borghese and have our lunch. But before we do that, we need a quick 20 minute walk down to our car to change the ticket and then we can head down to Villa Borghese. Which will be another quick 20 minute walk just to get there. I have to say, these kids have done amazingly. Stopped in the middle of somewhere so that Papa can go to the toilet and we can eat gelato. Beautiful. It was a good size gelato. Era buona. Huge size. Si. Avila Borghese. Yeah. We are on top of the world again. <laughs> Look at that. Playground, is it? Oh, is that a playground for the turtles? <laughs> no, no, not in there. No. Ah, uh, what are you doing in there? and pizza. Turn it around so I can see it. And inside, inside there, that's the way the Ooh, look what you made me do. Dove andiamo in macchina. In macchina.